Hi everybody, Justin and Crystal here with OurSleepGuy.com. Crystal's sitting on the Avocado mattress, I'm sitting on the Dream Cloud mattress. We're gonna do a quick comparison just to let you know some of the differences between these beds. So let's get started. So when it comes to what you're gonna get with both of these mattresses, as far as the Avocado goes, you are gonna get a 25 year warranty, which is really generous and completely coincides with the materials in this mattress. You're also gonna get a 100 night sleep trial period to test it out, as well as free shipping with the option of upgrading to white glove delivery and free returns as well. And with the Dream Cloud, you're gonna get a 365 night trial. You're gonna get a lifetime warranty. You're also going to get free shipping right to your door and you know they'll come and they'll pick it up for free if you don't like it. All right, so I'm gonna start off. I'm gonna talk about the comfort that I experienced when I slept on the Dream Club mattress. This is gonna be a 15 inch thick hybrid mattress. So that means that it's gonna have a pocketed coil system in its core and then you're gonna have multiple layers of foam as you go up. This actually has seven different laminated layers of foam as you go up. Some of them are gonna be latex, some of them will have some polyfoam, some memory foam inside of it. It is gonna be more of a luxury firm type feel. Um, so for those of you out there who are more side sleepers and you like something just a little bit softer, you may wanna go in a different direction. But if you're somebody who is a, uh, just a, an average sized person who likes to sleep on their back, likes to sleep on their stomach, uh, this mattress should be okay for you. The only thing that I don't really like about it is the fact that there's a lot of crowning that goes on throughout the top of this cover. Um, you do have this button tufting that runs down, but you, it, it just there's a lot of sways and lumps to it, and that's really the only thing that I didn't like when sleeping on it. So when it comes to the comfort of the avocado, uh, two of the biggest differences between the avocado and the dream cloud is the fact that this is going to be a hybrid latex mattress. So the only layers of foam over the top of this coil system in this bed are going to be completely 100% natural latex layers. Uh, now what that means is you're going to have a really durable high quality foam that's resilient as well as pressure relieving and it has a little bit of bounce to it as well. So it's not going to be quite as conforming but in a good way. It still is going to let you uh, alleviate pressure points but kind of give a little pushback at the same time. Now the second biggest difference between these two mattresses is the fact that you actually have two different options when it comes to the comfort level of the avocado mattress. Their original mattress is going to be an 11 inch thick model that's going to be more of a medium firm type feel where the 13 inch model is going to have two additional layers of uh, two additional inches of Dunlop latex and it's going to be just a little bit softer kind of bordering more on the medium feel. So both of them are really going to accommodate pretty much every sleeper across the board. Now personally, we slept on the 13 inch model and I thought it did really great for sleeping in every position. Uh, side sleepers are definitely gonna like this mattress a little bit better probably than the slightly firmer one, but both are gonna do really well for accommodating all sleepers, especially back and stomach. And both are gonna work really well for heavier sleepers too, just because of the materials in this mattress are really gonna be durable and resilient. So when it comes to the motion transfer between these two mattresses, there's gonna be some similarities and some differences. Both are gonna have that coil system that is gonna be individually wrapped, so that's gonna help reduce motion transfer in both of these beds. The biggest difference is gonna be when it comes to the foam layers. Uh, this is gonna offer a few layers of memory foam, which are typically a little bit more deadening when it comes to motion transfer, where the avocado is gonna use Dunlop latex. Now the one thing that's really nice about the Dunlop latex is that it's really dense and really thick and really durable. So even though there might be a little buoyancy to it, it's actually gonna do a really nice job of absorbing motion still. So when it really comes down to which mattress is gonna do better, uh, I would actually have to say that the avocado does do a little better. All right, so now let's talk about sleeping cool. Which mattress is gonna perform better? When I slept on both of these mattresses, I definitely have to say the avocado mattress kept me cooler throughout the night. Um, the Dream Club mattress has multiple layers. You know, it is a, a firmer base mattress, so you don't sink in too deep, but it definitely did retain more heat where the avocado is gonna have that aerated Dunlap latex. It's gonna have that organic cotton cover. It has that pocketed coil system, and there's just more breathability that, that goes all the way through the mattress. So if you're a warm sleeper, definitely go with the avocado. These mattresses are similar in the fact that they both have coil systems in, inside of them, but they are gonna be very different when we're talking about the top layers of foam, um, where the avocado mattress, when I sit on the edge of the avocado, 
you know, I have maybe a little bit of flex and when I sit on the edge of the Dream Cloud mattress, I'm going to have a little bit of flex. But the biggest thing is when I am sleeping on the mattress, the Dream Cloud is going to have its pillow top and then you're going to have more crowning that runs over the top. So you can't sleep right on the edge of the mattress without feeling like you're going to roll out a little bit. The Avocado is going to have more of a, a flat, smooth top pillow top. Um, instead of uh, this rounded top. So when I sleep right on the edge of the avocado, I'm just gonna feel like I'm going up and down. I'm not feeling like I'm rolling in, I'm not feeling like I'm rolling out. So with that, that's where I'd grade the avocado a little bit better. All right, so now let's just talk about the overall value between these two mattresses. Uh, you know, the uniqueness about the avocado is really that thing that sets it apart. You're gonna have organic cotton, you're gonna have Dunlap latex, you are gonna have just more natural and organic fibers that run throughout this bed, which in my opinion are just gonna, based upon the price that you're gonna get it at, just makes it a really, really good value. Um, it, I mean, it, it's just a great buy. I really like sleeping on the bed. This mattress right here, the Dream Cloud, it is gonna be 15 inches thick. It is gonna have a pillow top to it. It does have a coil system inside of it. But the one thing that I don't like is the fact that it is gonna come from China. So some of the materials inside of it are gonna be a little bit or a lot more questionable, um, you know, wondering exactly what's in those materials. You're certainly gonna have uh, some off-gassing that comes out of this mattress when you open it up, where with the avocado, you're not gonna get any of that stuff. So uh, just for peace of mind and, and just knowing what is inside of the bed and based upon these two prices of these mattresses, I'd have to lean towards the avocado. So thanks for watching the video guys. I really appreciate you taking the time and uh, checking out these two mattresses and listen to what we have to say about them. Uh, if you do have any questions, please send us emails or comment below. If this video was helpful, give us a thumbs up um, and just, uh, you know, just stay tuned for next time. Thanks everybody. Have a great day.